Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred On. This is your Tuesday edition of 7 O'Clock Spurs. And to say it's a slow news day would be, well, putting it lightly, to be totally honest. So, first up today, we've gone with the fact that Jamie Redknapp has gone out on Sky and bigged up Big Kevin Vimmer. That's right. He's talked about how uh, he was worried when Super Yan got injured that Spurs wouldn't be able to deal with it. But Big Kev's come in and he says he's been impressed. In fact, he said this, I feared for them when Yan Vertonghen was injured, but Kevin Vimmer has stepped in and they still look solid, while Kieran Trippier is showing what he can do too. Good old Jamie, he used to love talking about Spurs and banging on about how great we were when Harry was his dad. Good to see him still doing it now, although I didn't like it when he said he thought we'd probably just be Harry Kane and nobody else this season. He also came out this week and said he's been surprised by us and impressed by how good Deli Ali has been as well. Talked a little bit there about uh, Kieran Trippier. I think it'll be really interesting to see whether he starts on Sunday against Man City or not, or whether he'll bring Carl Walker back in. But what can't, can't be doubted is Trippier's ability on the ball and ability to get crosses in making more chances for Harry Kane. So it's much of a muchness really. What do you think? Who's going to start on Sunday? Let me know in the comment section below. Second bit of news today. It's barely even news as far as I'm concerned, but The Independent have done a big story on how uh, Pochettino is interesting the Man United boardroom in potentially instead of Jose Mourinho as their next manager. Uh, I saw the press conference yesterday with uh, Louis van Gaal or after the Chelsea game with Louis van Gaal where one of the interviewers actually said to Louis van Gaal, now that they're looking for your replacement, do you feel like it's good that you're uh, on better form? It's complete rubbish. This is all complete paper talk, complete bollocks. Pochettino's not going to want to go to Manchester United. He's in the Europa League. He's going to be in the Champions League. He's not going to want to go back to the Europa League. Uh, at a club that used to be good, as far as I'm concerned. I wouldn't be surprised if in the next four or five weeks, Pochettino has a lovely gleaming new contract with his name on it, and uh, Daniel Levy giving him a nice little bunce earner wage increase. Keep him at the club for the next 10 years. He, I think, in the whole of the Premier League, Pochettino has got the best chance to really make a legacy for himself at our club. It won't happen at your Chelsea's, it won't happen at Man United, it won't happen after the Wenger leaves Arsenal. These are all clubs that are going to bounce from manager to manager. Guardiola will only be at City for three years, so I think Pochettino has the best chance of creating something, taking us into a stadium and having this big legacy as the best Spurs manager since Phil Nicholson. Anyway guys, let us know what you think in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. Come on you Spurs. We were just all over them, especially down the left-hand side. Uh, Lamella had quite a few options to cross it. Ericsson, there were a few 